All right. Well, um, this is a description on how to add podcasts to your iTunes to listen. Um, when you open up iTunes, generally it will either open you up into the music store or your library if you have uh, stuff in your library already. Um, so to add a podcast, the easiest way really is to go to the music store here. Um, and if it takes you to some other page, like just click the little house icon, it will take you back to the music store. Um, up here in the top right hand corner of your iTunes um, is a little search the music store. You could type in something, um, some search term that would de possibly describe the podcast that you are looking to um, to find. I typed in digital photography. I'm going to go ahead and hit enter and it will do a search of the database bringing up a bunch of different podcasts. You can click see all and it will give you all of the podcasts that have uh, have came up with the terms digital photography. Um, to view what that podcast contains, you click the uh, the icon of the podcast and it will give you a better description. If you want to subscribe, you click subscribe and it will add it to your um, media player in the podcast tab right over here. So you can see now I have um, digital photography tips from the top floor and uh, generally when you add a podcast it will start downloading the most recent episode. Um, as you can see this was one that I was already subscribed to so I have some of them already in here. Um, other ones that I have not downloaded yet will say get. I can click get and it will start to download them. Uh, if you get a question mark it means that there's probably an error with the podcast. Um, I have it in here twice because they changed one of their feeds. If you have a problem with the podcast, you can go back and, and research for it and add it because maybe the uh, person administrating it made a change and you just have to resubscribe to it. Um, so you just click get and it should start downloading. You'll see the orange rotating in the process up here in the top, um, letting you know how much longer it has until it's fully downloaded. And when it's done, you have a podcast you can click on, and it will start playing um, it within your iTunes. Uh, if you have an iPod, you can also, um, through your preferences settings, set the iPod to, um, uh, to download the podcast into your iPod so that you can listen to them. But uh, that's a brief example of how... Um, to add podcasts, you can. There are a few other ways: dragging and dropping um, a add podcast link. You can do that by uh, taking the link that you see on your um, on a website and clicking it and dragging it in to your media player. You will see that the link that I am dragging creates a a green positive circle here showing that yes this is indeed something that can be added and if you went and let off it would add it to your playlist so that's another way of doing it if, it, if there's a feed link to that podcast you could just drag it and drop it in there um, to remove a podcast um, it's very simple you just click on it and you can right click and you can go to clear and it will ask you if you want to keep the files or move them to the trash. Um, keeping the files would just keep them on your computer. Moving them to trash is self-explanatory. You know, delete them, take them off my computer, and uh, and they're gone. So that's a brief explanation. If you have any questions or anything, I'd be more than happy to answer them. You could send me an email to jared at valcalnet.com. You can also go to jaredhill.com. Uh, my email link is available on that website. Um, so, uh, and it's also at the bottom of this video here, so you can, uh, write it down and shoot me an email if you have any questions. Thanks a lot for checking out this little tutorial. Hope you have an awesome day. Take care.